If you're trying to get your Sinti characters into Unreal Engine, uh, probably work smarter, not harder. <laughs> I'm going to show you how to do it really fast and really easy. Let's go. First, head to your downloads page and download the Unreal version of your Sinti assets. Then once it's unzipped, open up the Unreal project file. Once that's open, you can go to the Sinti folder, then to meshes, and then new characters specifically. Right click and choose migrate. Hit OK. Put this in the content folder of the Unreal project that you're working in. Once that's done, it will be in your project. Make sure you open up the new characters folder and all your characters will be in there. Now to replace the Unreal mannequin with this character, you can go to the Unreal third person character, copy the entire event graph, then open up the BP third person game mode, change the player pawn to whatever character you're deciding to use from your Sinti assets. In this case, I'll be using the clown male and then open up that blueprint, not the skeletal mesh, the blueprint. Then delete that event graph, paste in the one that we copied, and then go hit play. It's going to give you an error. Click on the third person character, delete this VR thing up in the top right, and now compile, hit play, and you can now control your Sinti character in Unreal Engine. Uh, I wanted to kill myself trying to figure this out. And now you like and subscribe for all the safe time.